hey guys welcome back to real nasser road to pro soccer and in today's video we'll learn 10 skills most effective skills to beat defenders but before we begin please take a moment to smash that subscribe button all right so let's begin with the skill number one it's the step over i'm sure most of you are familiar with the step over we'll be doing both single and double step over as you can see here i'm doing a double step over going to my right and striking the ball also remember to stay on your toes as it will help you with quick feet and you could also do a reverse step over as you can see here i'm doing a reverse step over going to my left and striking the ball and the skill number two is called the inside outside so as you approach the defender take a touch slight touch inside outside and then create space and strike the ball this will make you unpredictable because the defender will think you're going to your left but then you end up going to your right and creating space Alright, so for this skill number 3, I'll be using my right foot to roll the ball and then my other foot to move the ball to the left and then creating space to my left to strike the ball. This skill is a bit challenging, but don't worry about the speed, it will come once you practice more and more. But most importantly, you should get the technique right. Now let's move on to skill number 4, it's called the body feint, one of my favorites and most effective skill. So just drop your body to one side and go the opposite side. Let's move on to skill number 5, yet another one of my favorite and effective skill. It's called the fake shot and I'm sure most of you are familiar with the fake shot and as you can see there are different variation of fake shots so you can either do a fake shot and throw the ball behind you or you could do a fake shot and just push the ball out wide Alright, so the next skill is called behind the leg pull. You can see Neymar doing this skill most of the time. So you go, you pretend as you're going to your right, and then you pull the ba ball back behind you and then tap it inside with your inside foot and change direction. This skill can easily help you beat two defenders at a time. It's one of the most effective skills used by the midfielders in the midfield especially. Now let's move on to skill number 7, yet another one of the most important and effective skills used in the midfield area. And it's called the V pull, because the skill is pulled out in a V shape. So pretend as if you're going in one direction, pull the ball back and then push it to the other side, creating space for you to strike the ball. Most of the midfield players like Busquets, Modric and Iniesta use and perform this skill all the time. And the skill number 8 is called the chop, the most famous skill performed by Ronaldo and therefore the Ronaldo chop. And just remember to push the ball out wide before performing the Ronaldo chop. As you can see the skill will also help you to be in between the ball so it's hard for the defenders to get the ball. V 
This kill number 9 is an advanced version of the Ronaldo chop. And for this kill I'll use one foot to roll the ball and the other foot to perform the Ronaldo chop. And keep practicing to get the technique right. Alright, so let's move on to the last kill, skill number 10. You could either call it the inside chop or the inside cut, whatever you like. It's a very simple and effective skill to destroy defenders. So first take a touch with your outside foot and as you approach the defender, use your inside foot to cut the ball inside. Alright guys, thank you for watching, please make sure to like, subscribe and leave a comment if you have any.